Okay guys, so we are live at the Copley Theater and I'm here with the bartender Tanya. She's gonna let us know about the bar area. So if you come and see a show, definitely come talk to Tanya. Yeah, so. <laughs> Hi, Tanya. I think they've had plans in the making for years uh, and it never really started construction until about, well, it was definitely COVID. So they had nobody in the building and plenty of time and space to do it. Uh, it took them a long time because this was a complete full gut. I believe this bar itself used to be a bridal suite. Okay. So they completely cleared everything out and top to bottom redid everything. So what type of beverages and cocktails, non-alcoholic, like what do you serve here for, we serve for all, all the people the, that come to see the show? Okay. So we don't have a couple of alcohol effects, you know, such as flavored vodka, okay. um, but the most common things that people like to drink are all of the things we have here. We have delicious beer on tap. We like to carry at least one local if we can. Um, we have wine. Soda, um, all kinds of mixed drinks that you could possibly want. We have champagne. Um, it's a party up in here. That's what it is. <laughs> and has this been the first day it's open? Or? We've had a couple of events here. Okay. But as for the public, yes, this is it. This okay. is number one. So what's the drink of the night? Like, what's everybody been ordering? Well, I don't think the drink of the night probably has to be kettle one. Kettle one. And make Mark is a big one. Um, yeah. Alright. Everybody's mixed drinking it. Okay. Our drinks. Now this is an important question. Are drinks allowed in the theater or do they have to drink? Drinks are allowed in the theater. Yeah. You can drink in the theater. You can drink and at the same time. Awesome. Oh, your opinion for time. What do you think of the customers should try? Out of all the brands, beers, cocktails. My personal favorite out of our draft beers right now is the Two Brothers Domain de Page. It is delicious. It's a French country ale. Doesn't stay in your face all day. Nice and sort of light, but a medium, amberish beer. Okay. Delicious. And I would definitely recommend a Chardonnay just because I'm a Chardonnay drinker. Okay. Nice. <laughs> We also have the Cab and Malbec and Sauvignon Blanc and Pinot and all kinds of deliciousness if you like wine. Yes, sir. And we don't cheap out on it, so that's good. Yeah, so you will get your amount, guys. We carry good brands, and we can, we pour eight ounces of wine per glass. You know, some places they a little cheap -cheap sometimes, but not here. Not at the Kobe Theater. Not here. We are here to have a good time. We are here to drink. We are here to watch an amazing show. Yes. Um, as a bartender, how long have you been bartending and what do you love about bartending? So, I have been a bartender on and off for my entire adult life. So, since I was allowed to do it at 21, um, which is, you know, like 10 years. <laughs> Just kidding. It's a lot, a lot, a lot longer than that. Um, and I think my favorite thing about it because I stopped for a long time and then I came back to it out of choice as opposed to out of necessity. So I realized when I came back to it how much I absolutely loved it. And so I thought I was actually good at it. So it's fun to have the pressure of speed and getting drinks out, schlepping them out, and, and also having to have personality at the same time. Right, exactly. And joking around. So I think my absolute favorite thing about it has always been the people. People who want to come and hang out and have a good time. I bartend too at my job, and it's like you just want them to enjoy themselves, but also drink responsibly, responsibly, responsibly but enjoy themselves at the same time because we just want life to be great. Okay, so I'm gonna get a drink right now. Yeah, it's true. It's true. Positively, positively yes. come to the Copeland. Take it from the all the cards. Nice. Number one. 
Uh, <laughs> yeah. Thank you, Mr. Jenkins. Thank you, Mr. Jenkins. Okay, guys, so I'm going to order me kind of a kettle one, lime. Do you like it on the rocks? Do you like it in a mixer? Yeah, yeah. no mixer. I'm going, I'm going pure tonight. Yeah. Coming up. So here's the menu. Which I'm sure you definitely stay safe, drink responsibly, and tip your favorite bartender, which my favorite bartender is tea. <laughs> <laughs> Here you go, girl.